Hey, how you doing? My name is Frank Berenger, black tail, prairie dog. Today I have something a little serious to talk to you about. You may think that my life is all, you know, glitz and glam, being a celebrity prairie dog, you know, riding around on my bike, playing guitar, or whatever, Hollywood red carpets and whatnot. And it is. I ain't complaining. I got a good life. But today, I need to talk to you about something very serious. It's about the black tail prairie dog is in trouble. I'm going to read you a little article. Basically, what's happening right now is that tons of us are dying from the bubonic plague. The bubonic plague was like the black death it killed like most of the population of the human beings off the whole planet. And that's what it's doing to the prairie dogs right now. So they're spraying some kind of like uh, peanut butter flavored pellets around there. And uh, they're trying to like, you know, bait it and stuff so that these uh, fleas die and everything and that we stay alive. So basically the idea is if we got these fleas that are infected with the, uh, with the plague, we can bite your dog or something. Well, maybe we won't bite your dog. The fleas might, like, bite your dog. They'll go off my back into, a, into your dog's back. And then your dog sleeps on your bed. He's like this, you know. And those fleas, they jump onto your body. And then you get the plague. Now, a couple of people have gotten the plague. Recently, it's pretty messed up. I'm going to read you this article. What I'm here to tell you is that you should contribute a dollar... Five dollars, ten dollars, twenty dollars, or if you're one of those rich yuppie guys, you know, in LA or whatever, California, you know, with your four twenties and uh, your your vapes and whatnot. If you're over there and you got mad stacks, I want you to give some stacks to the Prairie Dogs, because your Prairie Dog Coalition needs your help. Basically, it's called the Prairie Dog Coalition. It's part of the Humane Society of the United States, PDC, Prairie Dog Coalition. You want to give some money to them so that they can take care of this problem and shoot those uh, pellets with the insecticide over there to, to kill those fleas and whatnot. And uh, I'm going to read you this here article. Okay, here we go. Rocky Mountain National Wildlife Refugee, 50,000 acre national area. Northeast of Denver, ba 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 ba. Plague infect infected fleas were biting black tailed prairie dogs. Officials began closing affected areas as a precautionary measure. All right, blah 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 blah. The risk posed post to hikers and pets is why certain areas remain closed. Dogs are less susceptible to the plague than cats, but may pick up fleas that can infect other animals and people. Huh? If you bring the dog home and he sleeps in your bed, the fleas can jump and get into you. Huh? Isn't that what I said? All right. Though the plague, the plague can be treated with antibiotics, it has a dark history. Uh, you know, it was responsible for the death of 60% of Europe's population during the Black Death in uh, 1900, rat-infested ships, blah, 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 blah. Okay. What they're basically saying is that these animals are in, they were, we're in big trouble, Okay. The fleas can also transmit the disease to humans and other larger mammals. Okay, in addition to fleas, humans can contract plague from coming into contact with the bodily fluids of infected animals or by breathing in the cough droplets of plague bacteria. Bubonic plague is responsible for 80% of plague cases in the United States every year, according to the CDC. A boy in Idaho contracted the plague last year. In 2017, Arizona officials warned residents after discovering plague bacteria fleas. In 2015, a star high school athlete died of the plague in Colorado. Yeah, that's where I'm from. So basically, uh, we're, we're dying and stuff. Uh, and uh, you guys are dying too. In Madagascar, it killed 202 people in 2017. Pneumonic plague. So this is no joke. Uh, if you got some money, even if you don't got some money, 
give something. Prairie Dog Coalition of the Humane Society, they need your help. Thank you, and let's say a prayer for all the prairie dogs out there that are fighting this battle right now. Black tails in the air. Respect. Peace.